Andy Erickson with Static Solar, and with me, I have Blake Layton. Blake is our lead engineer, Brad Layton's eldest son, who's an engineer in training. He's been doing his summer internship here with us at Static Solar. And one of the things that we've assigned Blake for a summer project is to explain the proposed rate increase that Northwestern Energy has the PSC voting on this September. You may have seen it on the internet or Facebook that Northwestern Energy has the Public Service Commission voting on a proposed rate increase that would affect those interested in rooftop solar. At Static Solar here in Western Montana, obviously we're very dedicated to rooftop solar, uh, but most people don't really know how the proposed rate increase would affect them as a homeowner or any person interested in rooftop solar. So Blake, do us a favor, explain to us what your research has found and try to explain the rate hike to a residential solar customer. Thanks, BD. So as we can see here on the graph, this is the proposed solar plan, no solar, and the current solar plan. And this is how much you're paying for electricity overall. As we can see with the proposed solar plan, it never pays itself off, whereas the current solar plan, it pays itself off after around 17 years. So wait a minute. With the new revised rate plan, solar energy would never pay off. Never. So why would you do it? You wouldn't. It'd be dead. Interesting. So with this 17-year payback, let me ask you, Blake, does this have the 30% federal tax credit in it or the $1,000 Montana tax credit in it? It does not. So right now we see around a 17-year payback, but with the tax credit you could see possibly before 10 years. Before 10-year payback. Now, we, most of us know that while life passes quickly, life is long. Imagine if in nine years your, your power was paid for. So right now really probably is the best time to go solar because the federal tax credits of 30%, those do begin to sunlight in January of the next year. We still have the full tax credits from the state. Solar equipment is the cheapest it's ever been, and this is truly the best time to go solar. Thank you, Blake. Nice work. Thanks, BD.